Scrapbooking.com Magazine presents the following Templates and Tools Department article from the March 2013 issue, Baby Unexpected, by author and artist Kay Wallace. My son and his wife determined their family complete after the birth of their second son. The years passed. Both boys were in school full-time and mom had returned to work. Then one day, tragedy struck, and a baby had to be removed from a relative's home. My son and his wife, along with their sons, agreed to volunteer to foster this beautiful child. Along the way, that baby became available for adoption. Since this little one had already moved into the hearts of my son's family, they applied and are now poised to adopt this unexpected baby in April. To create this layout, I used a sketch from the website where I have been a design team member. The word baby in the title was created using an embossing technique, a challenge from one of the other design team members. Instructions. Choose one piece of a 12 by 12 inch pattern paper. Choose one piece of 12 by 12 inch cardstock and a scrap piece of cardstock measuring at least one half by 12 inches that coordinate with your pattern paper. Trim your pattern paper to 10 by 12 inches horizontally and adhere centered horizontally to your 12 inch by 12 inch piece of cardstock. Adhere your three four by six inch photos to the pattern paper according to the sample layout. Cut, if necessary, your scrap strip of cardstock to one half inch by 12 inches and adhere across the top of your two photos. Using a rub-on of a sewing stitch, apply to the above strip. Use your personal electronic cutting system or other alphas to create letters and adhere the second half of your title below your two photos. On a separate scrap of white cardstock, stamp the letters for baby with embossing ink, then heat with seat gun. On a separate scrap of white cardstock, stamp the letters for baby with embossing ink, then heat with heat gun to set. Rub an ink pad of coordinating color over letters and surrounding area. Use a baby wipe to clean the ink off your embossed letters, then trim around your title letters, leaving about a 1 8 inch border. Adhere the first half of your title to the left of your two photos and slightly overlap onto the left photo. Adhere any other embellishments you like to complete your project. Kay Wallace has been a scrapbook designer and artist for more than 10 years, primarily designing wedding scrapbooks for clients worldwide. A printable project card showing instructions and a list of supplies for this project can be found by clicking on the step-by-step -step instructions link within this article. To find the products featured in this article and shown in these layouts, check with your local scrapbook retailer. Browse our premier retail stores for coupons to a store near you.